breaking news that's coming in. This one regard with the Morbi Bridge collapse. Now, the Gujarat Bridge collapse, of course, the case. The High Court has taken up uh, the Morbi collapse case and has made some key pointers. Now, what it states is no load test before reopening. Incompetent uh, agency given work and... Uh, HC seeks record of all Gujarat bridges, periodic audit needed of public places. So those are the key points that are coming. Now remember the Go uh, Morbi Bridge collapse uh, claimed over 135 lives. For more on this, I'm joined in by my colleague uh, Rishabh. Rishabh, good afternoon to you. Um, this, of course, you know, the key pointers, if you could talk to us about the fact that uh, the High Court has also seeked record of all Gujarat bridges and some key pointers that have also been stated is that the periodic audit needed of all public places uh, post that tragic incident. Well, the SIT report has clearly stated that there have been negligence in uh, opening, reopening rather, uh, the suspension bridge of Morbi. The court has also observed that uh, the, uh, the company that was, uh, that the MOU was signed with, Ajanta, has outsourced the work to a non-competent agency, which is Oreva. And now the court has asked in the next hearing, which is on December 21st, that the government should file all the details of MOU and Ajanta should file on what basis a non-competent agency was handed over the work, outsourced the work. So a lot of damning uh, observations coming in from the High Court. They also say that the, the load test was not done when uh, the bridge was reopened. So... Uh, a lot of answering needs to be done by the government, by Ajanta, by the local administration in the court when the next hearing takes place on December 21st. Rishabh, also when we talk about this particular case, with the fact that, you know, um, like you pointed out those uh, points over here, one has to remember that where does the investigation stand currently? Because we didn't hear anything from Oreva owners even at that point. See, uh, Oreva has not been named in the FIR as of yet. Uh, the Morbi uh, local administration has not been named in the FIR as of yet. So the investigation is still taking place. Remember, Gujarat is in uh, polling only today. The new government has sown in. So for last one and a half month, the machinery was busy with elections and uh, what not, including Morbi. So we'll have to wait for some time. We'll have to uh, wait for this government to kickstart its work to understand how and when the investigation will be. The court has been coming down heavily on uh, the police as well as administration to figure out what went wrong. But for now, the investigation also hasn't seen much of lead to per se. All right, Rishabh, I appreciate you joining us in the broadcast and getting us those latest inputs.